Hey guys, it's Candace Cruz for Red Carpet Report, and we are at the 2019 Ace Eddie Awards in Beverly Hills. Hello, oh, I love the pin. Oh, you, you have to represent. You gotta represent, absolutely. I love this. I love the first Incredibles. Oh. Let's not be like, let's not lie. Yeah. But Incredibles 2 had so many more like story elements yeah. to yeah. it, if that's the right way. Kind of topical yeah. stories for the, for the times, which, uh, you know, wasn't, wasn't really, I mean, Brad always knew he wanted to tell this reversal story. We always knew uh, it was going to be Helen's story. And, you know, it kind of, it, the society kind of, you know, the Me Too movement happened. And it, it just, I think it came out at, at a good time for um, for her, Helen, to be the lead in a film. I mean, it, I think it was great. Yeah. I mean, it's really nice for a woman to be able to be like, she's the superhero, you right. know, she's leading right. it. Yeah, leading I know my girls, know. I have two daughters, and they love the movie. They loved the fact that, you know, they see a girl kicking butt, and yeah, they love it, so. Now, what's the longevity from start to finish on editing a film like this? Walk me through that. Well, I mean, we're, we are certainly at Pixar, which we, we, we do, it's done, you know, I've been in animation for almost 25 years, and, and uh, we're, the editor is really on from the script to the final mix. So, we, you know, it's a four-year process, and uh, we literally are, from the very first writing, to the mix and of course Incredibles 2 we lost a year of production so we did it in three years which you know that was it caused a lot of uh, production issues and we had to kind of figure new ways to do things to you know departments were kind of on top of each other but you know we made it work I think we made a good film. No, I mean, I loved it. I loved it. It was great. And I mean, now we obviously have the Incredicoaster, everything in Disney, all the animations. It's amazing. Yeah, no, it's been fun. We, we got to go to the, the opening of the Incredicoaster. Yeah. It was so fun. It's a great, I, I love, I mean, I love the, you know, having done the first movie, I, I kind of have lived with this, our family, that I feel like they're part of my family. So I've been wanting to make this movie, you know, the whole time. Uh, and so it was great to be able to just work with Brad again, and uh, you know, the, a lot of a lot of the same folks that did the first movie were able to get back together and work. So it was great. And how old are your daughters? Are they five and ten? So they were there from the beginning till now. Yes, so did absolutely. they bring a lot of influence into some they, of the? They did. The girls did. Um, you know, my wife did. I know Brad's wife did. You know, there's a lot of. You know, we have to get perspectives from the other other folks in the room, you know, and so and, and, uh, that's that's on top of all the, uh, the females we had in story and editorial, you know, yeah. so it was it was a good uh, all around kind of production on the film. Yeah. Well, congratulations. Oh, it was fantastic. So now go get one of the cookies at the Incredicoaster because have you had one yet? No. It was the line oh. was so long when, it, when I was there last. Best so. cookie I've ever had. Really? So good. Oh, I love, go. we always hit that first when oh, we go, cool. so. Yeah. Great. <laughs> well, thank you so much. <laughs> thank you. If you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and comment below and let us know what your favorite movie of 2018 was.